Hi, it's Lenica from Lens Crafty Life and I received this package today. Now, it is a package with items, vintage items like postcards and French um, magazines that I bought at uh, via the Dutch Marktplatz, Dutch kind of eBay and um, I want to use that in my crafting so I'm really really excited about this haven't opened it yet just cut the uh, the cellar tape let's see and what I want to do with this especially with the postcards since they are old I could put them up um, as digi files in my Etsy shop so please watch this space I think I got everything out yeah. so by the time you see this video I should have uploaded um, some files uh, with these postcard images so that you can download them this is just stuffing oh I see some pretty postcards here oh yeah oh yeah I got quite a few and look at that oh so pretty I'm so excited here whole stack Ta -da -da -da. so I do have to see which ones I can upload which ones I can't because they have to be about 90 90 years old at least but these are from turn of the sin last century and these, this is the stack of that vintage magazines. Now, these are from about, here you can see, 1949. So I had a con contact with a French friend and she said, well, I would not risk um, selling these as digivials. So I can share these with you and I will use them in... Um, journals now if you are interested in getting one of these let me know i cannot make digi, digi files of it because of copyright so my friend said but i could send you one of these so let me start with these they are larger and then i will have all the space for the postcards after that so i'm really really excited about this because I've never had things like this, items like this before. Now, in all of the magazines, if you want one, um, just let me know. Send me, I'll put my email below this. I probably won't put them up in my Etsy shop yet. I may do. Well, check it out anyway. I'll pop a link below this video to my Etsy shop. If I haven't put this up yet in my Etsy shop, by the time you check it and you still want one, just send me an email and see if I still have one available for you. So, here you go. They all do have a fold in the middle. But personally, I didn't mind that because um, I'm going to use them in journals, the ones that I keep. So, they are, I think they are 16 pages. Two pages in each magazine are in colour. I think I will put some up in my Etsy shop. Anyway, just check it out. And these are all uh, black and white. They're very vintage, vintagey, vintage coloring. And these are uh, advertisements. It's all in French. They are genuine French fashion magazines. Oh, look at this with the brides. Oh, I absolutely love this. I'm not sure I can part with these. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying I'm going to sell them, you know. Maybe I don't even want to sell them. Well, I got quite a few, so <laughs> I will sell a few. Just see how it goes. See which ones I can part with. So, uh, anyway, so that is one. Then, so it's called Mode de Paris, Fashion of, of Paris. This one is from February 1950. This one was from November 1994. Oh, look at this. Isn't it? This is so pretty. I absolutely love these. All this fashion. And the ads. I'll go through it a little bit quick. 
because I have quite a stack. I think I got about 16 of these. And really nice, these, uh, these ads. Colgate. <laughs> Le Landemann Le Grasse à Colgate. <laughs> the next morning, thanks to Colgate, big smiles with white teeth. That's great. Very naughty of Colgate. Let me just see if I can uh, figure out how large these are. These are almost 31 centimeters, which is... 12 and I think 1 8 inch and they are wide 24 centimeters by 9 just over 9 and a half inch 9 uh, 3 8 inch that is so this one is from October 1949 oh look at this cute picture here oh and this gorgeous I absolutely love this this may be a long video if I do the postcards as well maybe I'll do the postcards in a separate video I think that's probably a better idea otherwise this may become way 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 too long so pretty look at it hmm love this so if you want to get one you can use this in journal making you can use it if because in card making in or wall hanging making in well whatever you can even put them in a picture frame some of these uh, beautiful images you can even put some on your coffee table as decoration that's what the lady i got them from she asked me what are you going to do with it so i thought i'll probably use them in some journal making some men's robes in here and then this one is from oh also from october this one oh from maybe i should see this say today this one was from the 21st of october 1949 this is 28 of October 1949 more like raincoats in here oh that is cool tulip perroquet okay never mind I thought this tulip was like um there's this artist, it's a Dutch artist, and he uh, paints tulips, and they are just so, so gorgeous. And I thought this might even be his, but it doesn't say... No, I mean, he's old and passed away. Not... <laughs> I just forgot his name. Anyway, I love those uh, tulip images of his. Um... If I remember the name, I can let you know. Oh, this is nice too. So this is just... Uh, I'm thinking of French words now. These are vêtements. Um, clothes. <laughs> just the clothes. It's, it almost looks like you can use this like a, for a dress-up doll. That's what it makes me think of. It isn't, but makes me think of that. And then this one is from the 11th of November, 1949. Very pretty, beautiful dresses. So there's lots of colored pages and like these black and white ones. They're beautiful. Oh, look at this. Okay, this one is from the 12th of May, 1950. Just love oh this one is a little bit damaged here in the middle but you know light of all and it's a little bit stained but that all goes with the vintage feel of it 
like tennis rackets. Ooh, would that be the outfit they would tennis in? Now you've got all these mini skirts and things. Oh, some beautiful images in here. Oh, little kitten and the doggy. These are more like summer dresses, spring. Here as well, all the short sleeve dresses. And then this is from the 28th of April, 1950. Again, some short sleeved ones. This is, of course, more like springtime. And beautiful ads. Lovely dresses. It's actually a shame that we hardly wear dresses anymore. Well, I don't. <laughs> I just find uh, trousers and especially jeans a lot more comfy and practical. But I do. Oh, this is a pretty one. From the 17th of February in 1950. But I do always like dresses, even though I don't really wear them myself. Oh, this one has like these pretty hairdos. So this is more like, a, you know, autumn kind of fashion. More long sleeved dresses. And here as well, more coats appearing. Beautiful. This one is from the 3rd of March, 1950. Yeah, some short sleeves appearing. Now oh, this is really nice too, isn't it? Very sexy lady here. <laughs> They're all so elegant. I'm just enjoying this. I hope you are too. This one is from the 17th of March, um, 1950. Beautiful hat. More long sleeved clothes in here, a watch makers ad. Beautiful dresses and more coats. Then this one is of the tenth of February nineteen fifty. about the way to wear veils, different kind of veils for brides. Oh, a lovely dress. Pour vous et pour la maison, for you and for the house. Oh, another bride. And here too. That's a very uh, business kind look-alike bride. And the little girl. Very pretty. More girls here. Then this one is from the 14th of October, 1949. Oh, pretty dress here as well. Most these ladies, of course. This one is from the 9th of September, 1949. Again, a doggy here. Pretty dresses and aprons. Oh, here you've got these little red thingies that you could uh, cut out to make little labels of or tags.
more children's from seven to ten years old really cute a pretty cushion here embroidered then this one is from the 2nd of September 1949 rentrée des classes so back to school So I guess we may get some, uh, again, children's clothes, although don't see it yet. Maybe it was just an article about children going back to school. Oh, here you are, rentrée des classes, yeah, from 14 to 16 year old. So this is all back to school clothes for girls, young ladies. This one is the 23rd of September, 1949. Lovely dresses, so elegant. And of course, they're all so skinny. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> these are garçonnettes. So these are little boys from six to eight year old. Or, well, a garçon is a boy, but I this is a girl, and I guess that's a girl. That possibly as well. Maybe garçonnettes is just children. Beautiful coats and with matching hats. Just all so elegant, isn't it? So more children's clothes and ladies. And then I've got two more. This one is the 6th of January 1950. So this is more winter clothing again. A lovely cape, cape coat. Mezena, we still use that. <laughs> It may be something different. Oh, this one has pretty colors. Not colors, but colors. Some boys again in here, girls and ladies. A robe d'après-midi. These are uh, jolie robe d'après-midi. These are uh, afternoon dresses. Can you imagine they used to just change throughout the day, like apparently a morning robe, an afternoon robe, and probably an evening robe. This one is of the 13th of January, 1950. Beautiful old car. Le Livre de la Semaine, the, the books of the week. So this probably um, tells about new books that have been released. Pour vous, madame, for you, madame. Beautiful. It's more like gingham, some gingham shirts in here. All gingham and checked. So I guess that was the fashion then. Here again, you see a lot of uh, checks in this one. Very pretty. So, so please do check my uh, my Etsy shop. I'll pop these down. Now, if um, I'll probably put it under one ad, and you'll just get a random magazine if you order one. Um, if you want a particular one. You could send me an email and, and ask me if I still have it. Um, but please do check out my Etsy shop first. And in my next video, I'll show you these. And I will start working on uploading these files. So you can uh, have some fun with these cards as well. as di digital files. So thanks for watching. 
and hope to see you in my next video. Bye-bye.